Hey guys, this is Kasi Akbar Gamer, and I'm back with another free itch.io game. This one is, this one is called A Mall Near You. A Mall Near You. It's a horror game about a mall near you. There's no menu, I guess. We just jump right in. Cool. Mom is telling us, all right, kiddo, you got all this stuff in your backpack, right? Because if you don't, we're not turning around. We need a gift for the holidays, and we got to return some items to afford it. Remember, the star plushy thing to Jill's, the t-shirt to warm subject, and the sponge to bathroom delights. I'll pick you up behind Saul, behind the, behind the Sauls. Try and get a good gift while you're in there, okay? Like that box of mac and cheese, the one with the famous Italian guy on it. If I give it to your pops, he'll be real happy. Don't worry, you'll be fine. You're such a big, brave kid. All right, see ya. How old are we? I feel like we might be a little child. Also, macaroni and cheese is a present? Okay. Oh, this is a neat way to, to um, introduce the, the controls and stuff. Wazd, tab for backpack, gotcha, interact E, zoom. Oh, <laughs> I don't know why, but I thought they meant like running like zoom, and that's that's not what they meant. Enter the mall? Not yet. Let's, let's look around a little bit. It says there's no ski masks allowed. Hopefully we're not wearing one of those. Is there anywhere we can go? Is there any like cool hidden stuff to find or nope, that's... Never mind, we're gonna go in the mall then. This mall is dead. Into the mall? Yes. Let's do it. This looks like so many real malls. It's um, kind of liminal. Tamagotchis, look at that. A bleeding edge virtual pet device. These babies offer seconds, seconds of entertainment really? stretched across several hours. <laughs> Why is that so accurate? They're definitely knockoffs and definitely illegal, which makes them pretty cool. Anything else we can? Look at, can I go, no, back there? No. Wow, I showed up just a little bit before closing time. Oh, right, I should probably like do my job. Hey, welcome to Jill's and stuff. You need any help? Yeah, I gotta return something. You wanna return, right, yeah, here. I'll give you a fiver for this. All right, cool. One of these star-shaped sucky things. Yeah, some kids claim these things started biting them. For real though, you should probably hurry and go home. It's getting late. I will, wait, what's this? Oh, I guess that's just something that fell off the shelf. Oh, these are the little things. Some of those plushes look awfully familiar. Is this even legal? Okay, cool. One thing down and we have two more to go. Is this like the Rainforest Cafe? Are they blinking? Yeah, I think this is like the Rainforest Cafe. I'm just gonna go away from there. Oh yeah, Tropical Diner, a wild place to shop and eat. Wow, they did, they did, oh God, that's terrifying. They did a good job on that. Good job, what's this? Here's a vending machine. It's got a bunch of really, really old snack bags in it. You don't recognize half of the snacks you see here and the ones you do recognize have logs, oh, logs, have logos that you've never seen before. Do you wanna buy a bag? Sure. Regardless of your choice, a bag of chalks pops out of the slot. The vending machine is clearly on the fritz. Chalks. You're not familiar with the brand, but it advertises itself as a challenging snack. <laughs> Love me a challenge and a snack. Too stanky to go in there. You need to get out of here now. All right? Not going to that bathroom. Uncle Urkel's. <sighs> Uncle Urkel's pretzels. Awesome. Urg. Ur. Oh. Ooh. Her. Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, I'm just gonna go, um, uh, um, rawr. What is that back there? What is that you got back there? Can I have this pretzel? Uh, let me ask, how are you? Oh, he talks regular. Okay, I'm okay, I guess. I don't get a lot of customers. It doesn't smell great back here and the roof is leaking a little, so kind of a rough shift, but you decided to ask me how I'm doing. No one's really done that before. Thanks for that. Really, I'm feeling a little better now. I'm usually pretty shy around people, but this was nice. Oh, now you're back to not actually talking. Let's ask why there's so many, so few people. Oh, he is just... Okay. That wasn't super helpful. All right, I guess that's... I guess we're done with him. He's got a bit of dust on him. Okay, that was fun. I don't know why it's still spinning around. I don't know if I'm supposed to take it or not. Maybe I don't have enough money to buy it. Oh man, 
Oh, I don't like these. Mannequins are on my list. Warm subject. Oh, instead of hot topic. Wow, I am slow. I didn't even get that. But when the mom said it, I didn't even understand it. Um, some of these shirts look pretty cool, but the others look qu pretty questionable. Looks questionable to me. What are these? Oh, oh shit. It's a bunch of pops. I just found a room of pops. Oh, and a maze. All right, we'll go back down there in a minute. Let's, uh, before we do that, before we go anywhere else, let's talk to this person who looks like they're really happy to be here. Yo, welcome to Warm Subject. You need something, bud? Gotta return this. A return, huh? Yeah, sure, no problem. It's just 10 bucks back for it. What's this return here? Oh, <laughs> someone got you this shirt, but you didn't want to hold on to it? Don't worry, I can relate. Honestly, kind of surprised someone gave you this. This girl's from a pretty obscure show, and it's not exactly for kids. Let's go through the maze now. The maze of, of Funko Pops. Oh, hello. Um, do you live here or something? The Fenkim freak. Hmm, I can sense it in you, but only a little bit. That instinct, a spark that has yet to grow. You're interested in collections, aren't you? No, I know. It's not the same as what I'm doing. Not the same as what I've given up to reach at this point. Come back when your collection has grown a little more, and I'll add to yours. All right, my man, or woman, or themen. <laughs> themen. What's that? Oh, what's that? What's that? The shelf is sparsely stocked with a few keychains still left behind. It's some kind of dog person keychain thing they're super marketable looking so what are they still doing unsold you don't feel like buying them but you know i don't know what he means by or they mean by continue our collection it doesn't seem to be working might be because it's not plugged into the wall that would do it that would in fact do it what does it say sorry we are closed but i want to go in there oh what's this it's locked i don't think that lock is doing much uh there's actually a lot to explore in this game oh what's this whoa what's this that's what i just said it's one of those cool pet games like the one from jill's the screen's broken the sounds crackly but it works and your mom told you not to root around in the trash but what does she know exactly i just got a free game thing you really hope this tastes as good as it smells i didn't realize this was like kind of a christmasy game hey yeah uh, welcome to bathroom delights what's up how can i help you um i gotta return this oh dear um Really sorry to tell you this, but I don't think I can accept this. I don't know where you got this from, but it definitely couldn't be from our store. They look kind of like ours, but they were taken off the market years ago for being illegally potent at sucking up water. Sorry, really wish I could help you more. Have a good one, okay? Mall's closing up real soon. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Can I can I talk to you about buying stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome to Bathroom Delights. You need something else. So what's is there cool stuff? Sure, there's a lot of cool stuff. I mean, a lot of places have closed down recently, but. Well, I hang out with some of the other people working here sometimes. They, they're pretty cool. They're not stuff, though. Sorry. I'd tell you to try the arcade, but that place just closed, too. Let me tell him I need to return um, this again. I hate to keep turning it down, but no, really sorry. Can't accept this. I'd get in a lot of trouble if I did, you know? Just hold on to it, okay? I bet a sponge like that'd be really useful in your day-to-day. So we're gonna hold on to the sponge, I guess. That is our sponge now. Saul's is where we need to go before we're done, but we're not gonna oh, we're not gonna do that yet. You take a seat, but you're pretty sure you'd fall asleep in one of these one of these things. Plus, they smell like some really bad cheese. These presents have got to be cool, like real cool. So cool that they've been put in prison, like the tree there. Those for the holidays. Did we come here like on Christmas day or something? I don't understand why everything's closed. Ah shucks, boss is gonna be real cheesed off if I don't finish up in time. Oh, hi kid. Sorry, just muttering something to myself. Ain't you worry about it. Go have yourself a nice day, okay? Let's ask him what's wrong. Really wanna know? Okay, okay fine. Can't say no to a helping hand even if it's from a little kid. Need something that can carry a whole lot of water in a tiny package, and I mean a lot of water. It's got to absorb the stuff. Most importantly, it's already got to be carrying that water. That wet, wet water. Need one. You got one? I do. I have that sponge. Don't bother, kid. I already know you don't got nothing like that on you. Like a fifth sense. Sixth sense? 
Whatever. Doesn't matter. Can't do real work without it. Much obliged for offering, though. Maybe one day I'll find one somewhere. Oh, it's not wet. That's why he won't take it. Um, where can we wet our whistle? I mean, sponge. Oh, a fountain. A fountain will work. Can I not grab that this fountain kind of smells maybe this the stagnant water it looks like it hasn't turned in a while no coins in here besides that big coin in the middle of it you got a sponge though using it here would probably void any kind of warranty for returns do i hate the water that much yeah i hate it with terrifying suction real localized in the palm of your bald fist all of the fountain water is fountains water zorps into your sponge that's a fun word zorp you've done it the water's all gone and so is your sponge actually not really the water is still there your sponge is still there too they've just become one single thing a wet sponge it's really heavy you go ahead and snatch up the big coin while you're at it yoink weird the moment you pick it up you feel a pair of wizened old eyes on you what like somebody's watching me huh i didn't even realize i could go up there before oh all right well we'll address that person in a minute Let's go back to the um, janitor. What is that? You have a hat that sparkles. Can I get it? No, never mind. Janitor, I have your sponge. Hey, you got it? Don't you get that thing? I could smell it from here. I might establish that I can do that. What? What did he say? I might establish I can do that? It doesn't matter if I didn't, but that's a real powerful tool you got in your hands there, kid. How about it? Give me that wet sponge. <laughs> like how it's like all capped and bolded in one word. They've just become one single thing. A wet sponge. Promise I'll make you worth your while. Yeah, sure. Take this disgusting sponge. Shucks, kid. Really made my day giving me that. Should be able to get all my work done for the night now. Here. This is for you. A key. Why is it in quotes? Should be able to open all kinds of gates. Uh to be able to open the gates of the arcade with that. Kids like arcades, right? Yes, I guess. Can I open this gate? Not that gate. Um, so let's go back down here again and check out some of these places that were closed and see if there's anything we can do with them. So let's go all the way back to the beginning because why not? We'll just check everything. This game has way more in it than I thought it would for, again, like a free game. Okay, I don't think we can open that. Wait. I can look at that trash. Nothing inside this trash can. Never mind. That's not a gate. Your hand just feels bad after digging in there. Huh. Huh. He just gave this to you for free? Oh, now I can pick. I couldn't pick it up any of the other times before. It doesn't actually look that appetizing now that you're closer to it, but free, free is free. free. You take the pretzel and wrap it up for now. It'd be wrong to eat it here probably be wrong to eat it in general because of how nasty it is i would like to be able to open this door can i not open my inventory i'm trying to open my inventory and i can't get it back open okay never mind then how am i supposed to get that it's still locked use the key yeah you wedge the key into the gates and violently prize the gates open bursting it open into a harsh wiry metallic boom you feel confident about your child's strength now you can enter the arcade. Yeah, but we only have so much money. I don't think there's anything we can do in the arcade. Yeah. You open that? No. Oh, this is how we get through here. I don't like this. I don't like this. Don't look at me. Ah! This wig. Uncle would love this for his head. It's quite greasy. Are, are they all the way they were before, or do they, are they looking in different directions? I, You know, I don't want to know the answer. It's fine. All right, so we got all that. Got all that. We're not going to go to Saul's yet. Um, I don't think we can open that. Let's try the escalator down by over here, the um, warm subject, and um, see who that weirdo is. Oh, we can't go up the down one. All right, fine. We'll go up the up one like we're supposed to, I guess. Oh, Polar Express 2. No, thank you. Jack Frost, that's fine. It was an okay movie. You watched your first movie here, then your second, and third, and fourth. The line hasn't really changed since... The lineup hasn't changed since then. Now that any of it matters now that it's been closed down for good. Luckily for you, you've still got your uncle's divix... 
collection to watch at home. Movie magic is ma magic still springs eternal with Divix. Divix. Oh my, Pappy's graveyard. Let's go ahead and talk to you. What are you so sad about? Um, um, pardon me, child, but did you just drain the fountain with that sponge? Was it just because you could? Well, I'm not looking a gift horse in the mouth, mouth, assuming that horse is inclined to give me a gift, of course. My young heroic friend, would you do me the honor of giving me that big coin? I promise to make it worth your while. Yeah, sure. Many thanks, my precious friend. Now, to test the legitimacy of this currency as only a professional can. He's gonna bite it. Honk. It's delicious. There's no doubting it now. This is the real deal indeed. As promised, here's your reward. A blank check from me to you. Don't spend it all in one place, yes? Not that you could. I promise that no number you put on there would be enough to hurt me. <laughs> I am richer than most countries. As for me, this beautiful piece of history shall go right into my pocket. Ah, uh, I can feel its... Oh, wait, there's a hole in his pocket. I can feel its inex expedient weight upon me already. Um, it fell. The big coin fell out of the old man's pocket. Take it. Can I, can I give you the coin again? I must thank you again, my friend. This has been truly a red letter day. This wonderful news has completely offset the fact that my suit desperately needs mending. Oh, I guess he doesn't really care. That's fine. I guess I'll just hold on to this giant coin. Do you follow me around when I move? Yes, you do. Okay, great. This is furniture outlet. Look at that thing. This is freaking sweet. You wish dinosaurs were real. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Hello, person who's overly happy. Hey there, sport. You know where you are now? The furniture outlet. An outlet for all your furniture furniture needs. Like the motto, I came up with it myself. Oh my god, look at his eyes. Oh, oh my god. Um, I can't wait to hear what corporate has to say about it. Silly me though. I should I should be asking you what you need. What do you need, champ? Uh, I'm gonna ask for the dinosaur. Can I have that dinosaur? Oh, that? Sorry, amigo, but no can do. That girl there is the cornerstone of my cornerstone of my store. She's the heart of this business. Really? I can't even think of what my store would be like without her. Yeah, uh, what am I going to show him? Yeah, but check this out. Check what out? The coin? Look at that face! Oh my. He really knocked it out of the park with that one, hot, hot shot. It's been a long time since I, I've seen a trick that sick, as in cool. It really brings me back to my childhood. Can you show me how you did it? Yeah, for a price. There's a lot I could give you for that knowledge. A new couch for your family, maybe? A dining table? Or how about a chair? You know, chairs are all the rage now. How about it, Superstar? I want the dinosaur. Am I just going to carry this dinosaur around? Done. Expect it tomorrow. I gotta admit, little fella, it's been a real, real long time since I faced down a challenge like this. <laughs> to be honest, I'm missing her already. Even if she's standing right there and I could just take it back. But a deal is a deal, buckaroo. You taught me how to do that flippin' sweet trick, so I'll follow it up on my end. Oh, we didn't give him the coin. We just showed him a cool trick, which is awesome. Why is he staring at you? You're only touching the cash register. That's probably why. Uh, where might I find the macaroni and cheese that I'm supposed to be getting? Is it at Saul's? I think it, I know I have to meet, like, my mom person at Saul's, but I don't remember if she said the macaroni and cheese was there. Let's go to Saul's. It's also eerily empty. Is that, is that what's-his-face from, um, The Mummy? I think that is what's-his-face. I cut out a famous Hollywood actor, Brendan Fraser. Yeah, Brendan Fraser, Fraser, depicting the heroic Rick O'Connell from The Mummy 1999. It's fair to say that his performance in that film was an absolute breakout. Your mom loves this movie and this man. It'd make her real happy. I'd love to ask the cashier about the price, but she seems to be asleep. Can I just steal it? Which I wouldn't do. What is this? A bunch of branded macaroni and cheese boxes spread loosely on the table. Tony's Macaroni. A middling successful attempt to use James Gandolfini's likeness to push packs of macaroni and make a middling successful 
a middling successful gift, but the clerk is currently asleep to sell it to you. Okay, let's talk to the sleepy employee. She's just snoring. Huh? Oh, yeah, hey, can I help you? Are you uh, trying to buy something? Closing up soon, so... If you want any of this stuff, go ahead and, like, look at it and stuff. Yeah, I want to buy... I want to buy this. Oh, you want the Brandon cutout. Um, so, like, that's not supposed to be for sale. But if you have a lot of money or something, maybe I could sell it to you. It'd have to be a really goofy amount of money, though. Okay, so I'm going to give her a goofy amount of money on that check. What? Uh, um... Okay, fine. Yeah, sure. I'll take that check and you can... Yeah, yeah, it's yours. Great, we got that. And I want to buy the macaroni, too. Oh, yeah. Tony's macaronis. Oh, I get it. I get Tony's. Yeah, I get it. Okay. Tones macarons. Tonus macaronis. Yeah, um, 15 bucks. Sure. Huh? You're like a dollar off sorry but i can't sell it to you not even if you asked twice i'm gonna ask twice tony's mac Ugh, do you have enough for it now sure huh oh sure fine it's all yours great thank you for that that's that was awesome thank you i mean i did give her a goofy amount of money for the cutout so it's kind of like the least she could do maybe i don't know is there anywhere else to explore anything else to do exit over here no bye bye can't leave this way the doors are frozen shut can i use the pry bar or something can't go that way either because it's barricaded um i'm out of money oh 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 let's go back and check in over here with the collection thing and what, see if we have enough stuff or whatever. Yes, that's it. You fanned the flames, haven't you? Scrounged and strived until you've gotten just about everything you could find in this place. I haven't met a lot of other people with this kind of fire. I admire that. I appreciate it. Here then, one more for your collection. I'm grateful, grateful to have come here. Grateful to have met you. Now, know this was all worth it. Still, try not to end up like me if you can help it. It's nice to have a hobby, but that's not always true for obsessions. All right. Thanks for that. So, can't leave this way. The doors are still frozen. How am I supposed to get... Can I use anything in my inventory? No. Now that I have everything, maybe I can go this way? No. Do you know how I can get out? Okay. Okay, so she asked me if the mall was closing. I said yes. Yes. Oh, okay. So I just needed to tell her I was done. Oh, shit. Oh, this got scary. Oh, shit. Okay, 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 okay. This is, as somebody who worked at a mall, at a, at a Spencer's in a mall for a while, this is exactly what those, like, tunnels and shit behind the stores in the mall look like. They are this creepy. They are dark. They are just these narrow tunnels. Ah! Oh, hey, what are you doing here? Okay, I, I'd like to see who I'm actually talking to. Oh, it's just you. Sorry. I think I was walking to my car so I could, like, go home. Hey, kid, it's, like, really late. Is someone supposed to be picking you up? The exit's down this way. Or in front of you? Sorry, I'm a little bleary-eyed. I might take a breather for a sec before I go home. All right. But yeah, this is this is what those tunnels look like. This is very similar. Yay, there's our mom. Great, is that it? Okay, so it was a little scary. It wasn't too bad. 10 out of 10 gifts. Oh, look at that. That was great. That was that was really good. Recommend I recommend this one. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 gifts for 10 out of 10 game. If you like that, like, comment, subscribe, follow on Twitter, link below. You know the drill. I post videos Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So come back for that.